Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper Sai. How the devil are you, mate, today? We're looking at the one and only. Oh my gosh. Make sure you go to his channel, subscribe, and do the thing. Now, listen. Oh my gosh has got millions of subscribers, and he's like the O. He's one of the OGs of the YouTube paranormal game, okay? And he recently did something which was absolutely incredible. I think he pretty much did the biggest paranormal collab that YouTube has ever seen. So if you don't know, Omar Gosh basically contacted the vast majority of the paranormal community and said, look, I've got this idea. We will come to together as one, right? And we put together a series and you go into like different haunted locations alone and we'll document it. So I wanted to react to one of the episodes and this one is Can I Survive Here Alone? Paranormal Edition Series 1, Episode 7. So you could go over there and watch the whole series. So yes, we have got some of the best paranormal channels all together in Oh My Gosh's uh, channel. It's right. Well done to him. Well done. Uh, hats off to you, mate. You have to excuse me. I'm a little bit under the weather. I'm still recovering from like um, a cough, cold. Man, it was it was it was terrible. So you have to. I'm just. I'm basically. I'm just chilling out today. All right. I'm just chilling out, sitting here in my sweats, and I'm just. I'm just creating content. Ill. That's what I'm doing. I'm ramboing it. All right. So. Ah. Fuck. Ah. Ah. I'm ill and hurting now. <laughs> Without further ado, Dardilly Day, let's do this. Shh. Go on, oh my gosh, and everybody else. Hey, paranormal. Yeah, come on. Whoa. I'm going to get lost. Paranormal Nightmare TV, mate. Brilliant. What was that? What was that? What was that? What was that? Here he is. Why do I do this sh Oh, mate. Come on. Yeah. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, man. This is like watching a fucking Netflix television program or something. All right. Pythian Castle, never been here before, all alone. We're gonna go to probably one of the least places I wanna go in the first place, and that's the basement. Oh, well, that was him. Way out of my comfort zone. I'm scared of clowns and other things, but like castles freak me out. <gasps> oh, fuck. Oh, <laughs> it's like a freaking gargoyle over there in the distance. So when I was down here earlier, it actually looked like he was moving and breathing. I think he is. I don't know if it's the amount of- That reminds me of Ghostbusters. Limestone that's in here, but it just feels off. Wow. Oh, that's mate. a little spoopy. Ominous. Oh, 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 oh. Who's there? What the hell touched my REM pod? <laughs> what the hell is that noise? Oh. Making my way upstairs because I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> That would be damn freaky, though. In there alone, mate. Right, you've got to just try to get your head in the game here. Right? Put your head into their heads. You know what I mean? Right? It's freaky. Hello? Who's making all that racket in here? Oh. Okay, down the hall over here is where people see a little boy named Pete. Hi, Pete. My name is Omar. I'm here to hang out with you. Oh, check it out. All these little toys. Oh, mate. Every squeak would freak you out in that place. Is Pete here? Oh, oh that's it, Pete. Shit. Pete is here. Oh, my camera's overheating. It's me. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Whew. Yo, so my camera's overheating. I need to turn it off for a second. That sucks, man. When you're recording 4K sometimes, it just fucking cameras just overheat. You gotta sort that shit out. It's 2023. Sound like I just heard a little kid in the corner right now. Is that you, Pete? Oh, mate, this is good. Is he hiding? 
This is like some sort of foul right footage. Now I am using my POV camera because my main camera started overheating. Very unfortunate, but hey, I'm glad I have another camera on me right now that I can record because it's always when I turn my cameras off that something happens. Who else is in here? Oh. Are there any other children in here? Mate, that was a legit response. Can you make my REM pod go off again? Okay, I'm gonna pick this up. This is freaky, we mate. To the attic before we make our way to the most scariest place where some of the workers don't even like to go to. And that's the tunnel. You know me, I like haunted tunnels. What is up here, though? Oh, my what is God. That? Okay, sounds like a bunch of police sirens. Sorry for that noise. Whoa. This looks like a lifesaver. Not a lifesaver, but a lightsaber. You know, like a Star Wars, like... Mm, mm, mm. Let me get the right... Hey, that was a pretty good sound. Color, though. <gasps> Whoa, cool. It's like a mini Star Wars dagger. Short and stumpy, mate. Probably not something you want to be um, raving about. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what's going on in here. No idea. But holy crap. She is a little creepy. I wonder what's behind this door. All right, the only thing that's gonna keep me from doing the ghost paper challenge, oh, it has to be something serious that I'm just terrified. Of. But that's gonna happen if I don't go. It's walking down there. That's a pretty cool light. Oh, listen. Listen. That's legit walking. Okay, now the first. Mate, that's legit walking. Step stop. Oh. Is it the owner? Camera. Oh, mate. Okay. The, right there is when you'd start to just really like you, your mind would just go overactive and you start getting super paranoid. Your knocks all around me. I could totally see weddings being here. Let me know what you think. Would you get married here? I totally would. I'm pretty terrified right now because where I seen that shadow man is where I have to go back to. And I mean, it's like when I was done with the basement and- What, you saw a shadow bastard? Some things happened down there. It was like a sigh of relief when I came back up and it was like, wow, I did it. But then when I walk up to the second floor, I'm like, Knucklehead, you completely forgot to go and visit Mr. Boots in the tunnel. And that's what they call him. There's a spirit down there that is known as Mr. Boots. Mr. Boots, our most interactive ghost, is in there. We know he's military. Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean by interactive? <laughs> he will play along with you. He will interact with you. He is one of the intelligent hauntings we have here. You don't want to go in there and provoke. Yeah, do it, mate. Do it. Just go in there and wreck the joint. Yo, here I am again. Rambo it. With that breathing gargoyle. I mean, it really does look like it's breathing. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Oh, 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 shit. Who's down here? What's 
that a sound? I don't want to go in there. Oh! Uh, yeah! Yeah! Oh! Uh. Mate, hats off to the editing. In incredible, mate. Hello, Chris. All right, guys, I am completely alone. First stop, the crypt. Tales from the crypt! This is where over 3,000 bodies were stored during the winter months. Oh my gosh, guys, the energy in here is so heavy, it's, it's almost suffocating. Ooh. So I feel like there is something here that likes to pretend that it's a lot darker than he actually is. But I know that you're not demonic. He's okay? over there. I just got literal chills. I'm yeah, probably because there's a skeleton behind you. <laughs> I'm gonna sit down right here. This is where you are. It's so strong. I just... Frank. Oh my gosh, guys, that said Frank. Frank. I'm saying there's a male spirit that is coming through so strong right now. What the f was oh, that? Shit. Something just walked across the door. There was a black shadow that walked across the store right now. Nobody else is in here with me. That no. spirit's here. Are you oh. trying to warn me? This device? Yeah, yeah, I think so. <laughs> Bad spirits are here. Are you trying to warn me? Yeah. What the f I think I'm going to head upstairs. <laughs> by myself we are coming up here i feel like i can easily get lost in here oh my god look at the state of this scene mate jeez louise look at it man Shit just got real what the f am i doing this is the ballroom area what the f was that oh my god i'm like literally shaking something just like totally turned this camera off like the clip isn't even here anymore the camera's oh. black i don't know what the f just happened not gonna lie my heart is racing <sighs> scotty i need you to let others come through and talk to me is that okay <laughs> scotty is that you i do not give you permission she clearly didn't bring any bottles of water so she's got to try and find it now to touch me watch me you are not allowed to touch me. I do not give you permission. I feel like it's not even Scotty that wants to touch me. I feel like there's something darker here than Scotty. That's kind of what I'm picking up on. I can't even tell you like how nerve wracking it is. I can show you. Oh, I can show you. Oh, baby, come on. Yeah, I'm telling you. There's something a lot heavier and darker here. Oh god, is it <sighs> quite a bit of energy here, oh, guys? It is so f overwhelming. I can't figure out why I'm so out of breath. And I asked, Are you making it hard for me to breathe? It said, Yeah. Like, my heart is racing. I wish that I could show you guys my heart rate because it is f up there right now. Oh, look, she's on the this edge. This is nothing. Like, the way that I see energy is kind of like a gray scale, like <clears throat> light and dark, like black and white. This room is kind of gray over in that area over there. It gets a little bit darker. It gets a little bit darker down there and it's just completely dark upstairs. Like I don't see any light. Can you show me that you're here with me somehow? Put the spirit, the other spirit box app on and see if anything else pops up. Florence. Okay, so we got another name. Are there things that happened here that nobody even knows about? What is these things? I, I know what they are. I thought they were for finding water. All right. So what are we looking at here? Is this sort of direction of where the spirits are? Is it a cross means yes, wide means no? Like what? what is that? Yes. Scotty, if you're here with me, can you show me where you're standing again? Oh, okay. It does lots of things. Are you having a laugh? Guys, this is literally pointing to the same exact area. I, in fact, th th this reminds me of a video I saw a bloody ages ago about a woman from years ago, mate, in England that would use these things, dow are they dowels and sticks, for finding water, mate, and she's fucking freaking out like this. And, and she's 99% 
true on every reading she finds, mate. It's absolutely incredible. I might put a little scene in it in here. Like, it's crazy. Meet Catherine Brent of Deverin, Cornwall, whose physical reaction to water is so strong that she is literally pulled this way and that in the direction of the underground stream she locates for Cornish farmers. Catherine has located 300 deep boreholes and has been right 98 times in every hundred. I don't even want to turn around because honestly, like, I don't even know what he looked like. I don't even want to know if I want to know what he looked like, if that makes sense. <sighs> I just heard, I don't know if that was like a little girl or if that was a whistle coming from down that hallway right now. Wealthy. Wealthy, yeah. You all had quite a bit of money to be here. I'm gonna be real honest with you guys, like, I don't want to go up to the third floor, but I feel like, I feel like I have to. I'm gonna show you guys around the second floor just a little bit. Over there. Yeah. I know you're here. To the right of me. I feel like there's some spirits here that are having trouble communicating. I don't know if it's Scotty's energy holding them back. I feel like there is something that is very dark here that likes to pretend that it's demonic, but it's not. There is something over here that's drawing me to there. So let's go Children. Children. Oh, right. Yeah, there is a little girl here. I knew it. I knew it. I'm going to leave the room. She's like Claire of Voice, but I quite like her. I might have to um, find her channel. Pod rolling, actually. Let's just leave that rolling right now. Um, and then if it goes off, we'll be able to hear it, but... There's really not too much activity. Sometimes spirits like to communicate in different ways. So I started in the ballroom. I wanted to do like a dowsing rod session with the spirit box rolling and got some intelligent responses to my questions, very specific responses. I did feel like there was other energy trying to come through, but the man was not allowing it. So I did tell him a couple times to step aside and allow the other spirits here to communicate and at one point i was being drawn more towards the front of the building on the second floor okay Ready? yeah yeah mate this this girl she's physic mate she's physic oh my god what was that nevada baby indiana i love this bit this is so damn good omar congratulations mate on the editing and putting this together, dude. Hey, Josh, mate, here we fucking go. Here's the man, here's the man. Hey, Josh, paranormal nightmare, come on, baby. Josh is a fucking legend. All of his brothers are. Right now I'm at the speakeasy in Hartford City and we are getting stuff. This building is huge. It's good actually because when I watch his um, his main channel, because obviously he's round with all his brothers, he always re remains probably the calmer one out of all of them, right? <clears throat> so him being alone is um, it's going to really sort of bring his barriers down, right? So he's going to be freaking out quite a lot because he hasn't got his brothers to sort of be there for him. Hello, I've literally been in here. Two minutes and shit's already happening. So this right here is like the main room. So this bar right here, other investigators that have been in here have had these shot glasses tip over. <laughs> That's some strong stuff. Drink it, okay, lick it, lick it. In here. I'm gonna pour you a little drink. I'm gonna, <laughs> gonna pour you a little drink. <laughs> pour myself a little drink. Only the finest brandy for you. Ooh. <laughs> Come the end to be like, I think I've seen. Uh, uh, a shadow bastard go, so we can have a little look and find out for ourselves. <coughs> Holy Jesus. Shit, that's that strong. Yeah, I bet. Are you out in that hallway? Was that you? So this is the room where they filmed a bunch of satanic stuff. Oh my and god. And people say that they see dark shadows. Yeah. Did somebody do something with Satan in here? So what I like to do is walk around until I feel an area that just feels uncomfortable and then focus my investigation there. Definitely this room right here so far is the creepiest feeling. I'll tell you what, let's um... Now I'm in complete darkness. Who did we hear walking back here earlier? Oh, mate. Can you hit something really hard for me? What? Okay, that was wild. I didn't hear that. I heard you. 
Oh, I heard that. Who's back there? Yeah, there's nobody back there. Oh. <gasps> Run! This is crazy. <laughs> me. Can you hit something hard for me, please? Validate to me that you're here. Oh, hell no! Validate to me that you're here. Oh, I I'm heard. Here. I don't know if he, he said I'm here, but I definitely heard something. That said I'm here. Something keeps walking down there. Oh. Look, I just came to this hallway where I've been hearing all the noises, the hallway that feels the creepiest, and the alarm just went off. I can hear you. Do something louder for me. No. <laughs> He's like, motherfucker, I'm gone. I'm gone. Thank you. Okay, that was loud. Can you come up to my alarm right here? Like I said, I try to feel, go to an area that feels uncomfortable because your body should always be your first tool mm. when you investigate. It's like if you go to a room and you feel uncomfortable or unsafe, that's your body telling you that there could be something in there. And that's where I like to focus my energy. I bet this hallway is at least 10 degrees colder than the rest of the place. Can you hit that again for me? That's what she said. <laughs> I'm gonna see if the wine glass moved. So this is an area here, this room. It's kind of all gutted, but like being right here, this feels warm but if you remember this is the room i got that real loud bang i think people have heard a female in this area oh alarm's going off did you just walk past me my alarm just went off can you move away from my alarm back up about two feet Back up! Please? What the hell? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you! Does that mean you're in here with me? I did hear that, Josh. I did, mate. I did, mate. Yeah. It's like a... <sighs> that was a scream. Oh, shit. Knocking. Are you the female that everybody sees in here? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to set my alarm right here, okay? I'm going to get my voice recorder out again. Who is the woman in this area? I'm just here tonight to talk to you, to find out if you have a message. This is the one. That, that you're gonna hear something now, you mate. You try really hard, I can hear you. This is it, Josh. That's the right question, mate. I'm just here tonight to talk to you, to find out if you have a message. That, that's the one. I'm oh, going to shit, I, fri I, fuck I freaked then, mate. I thought that was it. Oh, alarm's going off again. Can you move away from my alarm, please? Thank you.
I feel like you're a nicer spirit than what's back in that hallway. Think again, motherfucker. Are you nice? If you're nice, you can set my alarm off again. But if he's not nice, mate, he's gonna pretend, isn't he? Or she. Hey, I'm gonna go sexist. to the other room. I'll be back. You can set that alarm off anytime you want, okay? So I'm gonna go check on the um, shot glass. Let's see if it moved. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna sit in here for a few minutes. I can't tell you how dark this freaking place is. Like, it is super dark. Yeah. I'll show you guys. Whoa! Oh, what? 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 What the fuck has happened? Oh, what? Maximum cliffhanger, please! Call it, mate! Baron Over Fight, let's go! It's not looking. It's Jesus! Good for me tonight, everybody. All right, I'm not gonna lie. This is probably the most freaked out I've been. One of the most, I can't even think right now. About as scared as I've ever been. It's pitch black and it's just me. Here we go. Mate, look at the stairs. vibes in here, but let's see if we can talk to anybody. Bad dude, somebody literally just walked in. Thank you, come on over. I'm gonna pack up and go up to the second floor. I thought that was it then. He's like, I'm gonna pack up and fuck off, mate. It's too horrible. <laughs> Literally, one, one beep. Right, that's it. I'm fucking done. This is your last chance if you're down here. Oh, I just went off right next to me. All right, so I'm here in the cafeteria now. Definitely feeling a little darker in here. I have a tool here. It should allow me to hear what you have to say. Take picture. Oh, go on then. I'm not gonna look at them until later, though. Who's here? Killer. Oh, f oh shit. I've never gotten that word on there before. Okay, are you telling me that there's a killer here with me right now? Dude, it's f free. She's here. Oh, Ooh. she's here. She's here. It got so cold in here, man. It looks like he's sweating his tits off, mate. Back of my head is really killing me. Such a sharp pain in the back of my head. Oh, she stabbed somebody in the head, mate. She stabbed somebody in the head. Do you regret killing somebody? Neither. You're apathetic? Okay, I'm officially creeped out. Bye. Oh, no. I'm gonna head down right now to solitary confinement. As you can see, you would be in a very small cell in here. I'm gonna sit in here for a little bit. I'm gonna do a spirit box in here. Can somebody let me know if there's somebody here with me right now? Bro, touch one of the lights. Oh, no way. No, wow, mate. Kill. Oh shit, run! Oh. Are you out here? If you're in one of those other cells, can you step out into the hall? Albert. Albert. I'm out in the hall. Can you show me which cell that you're in? All you have to do is walk into the doorway. Williams. Mate, maximum names. Williams. So many names. Yeah. You know what's really interesting is upstairs, it was giving me a ton of women's names in a row, and it said, she's here, killer. And it says down here, kill, and it's been all male names. Oh. I just heard something over there. Have memories. Have Have memories. memories? Are you over there around the corner? Imagine a shadow bastard now, mate, walking past there. Can you make a sound and let me know where you are? Agitated. Agitated. Oh. Are you angry that I'm in here talking to you right now? What the fuck was that? 
<laughs> oh shit, mate. That was, that was legit being scared. Legit, mate. That. 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 Oh, mate. What the f... No way. <sighs> That, that light just flickered on and off in the f***ing... You can tell he's shitting it, mate. Look at him. Solitary wing. <coughs> oh, look. He's going he's gonna to throw up black shit now. Hold on. I need to catch my breath. I'm stepping farther away from there. Because... That was really scary. Oh, dude, all my shit's down there, man. F*** that. Imagine if it flickers on and off now, mate, huh? It's like... Okay, if that's you, down there in solitary, can you flicker that light again? Do it again! Oh, stop it! Oh my god, that noise in there. The voice just gave me a heart attack. Can you do something else down there? Oh, mate, this is freaky. I can't hear what it's saying. Get in there, I, mate. I was, like, really confident, like, oh, yeah, this is going to be scary. And then I do not want to go back down there to even get my stuff. <laughs> I'm not being a wimp. I'm like... No, so, you are, mate. You need to Rambo it. Something just feels really wrong about being here by myself. And, like, I've done hundreds of ghost hunts, but there's something about this right now that is, like, peaking my anxiety. Seeing that means that it is uh, powerful. F*** it, dude. I'm going to call them. I'm going to call Omar. Okay. I can I fucking get in there, man. Get in there. I would. I'd Rambo the shit out of it, mate. Okay, so... I've been sitting here. I've decided to just go down. I'm just gonna get my stuff. I'm gonna go to a different part of this prison because if I had another person with me, I would be totally fine with staying here. So I'm gonna go down, turn off the light, grab the stuff and just move on. Mate, you need to stay in that location. Okay, stay in there. Get every single pit, bit of equipment out and rambo the shit. Hello? Oh, mate. Woo hey, hey, mate. This is good, man. This is good. That song. Here I am. That breathing gargoyle. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Who's down here? I don't want to go in there. Get in there, mate. Dad. Dad. That. Oh god. Oh god. Why do I do this? Shit? Great. My light is getting ready to die. As soon as it hits red, yeah, my luck. Oh. Right, I know I'm not hearing things. Am I hearing things? Fuck off, mate. Who's there? Oh, look at that doll there, mate. Look at the state of it. Mannequin, even. It's not a doll. Oh. Fuck 
freaking how? What's that sound? It's a maximum this cricket. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what it is. Are you the one making all that noise? Oh, the boiler? Okay, makes sense. Makes sense. Boilers do make some noises, so do water pipes. Look at this place here, mate. Look at this place. This is like some sort of horror game. There is the tunnel. The first black shadow I saw with my own eyes was actually at the tunnel. Took a small group down there, only had a few people with me that night. Just a regular tour. And as I came around the corner of the boiler, I looked up and the entrance of the tunnel was lighted. And there's a pipe that hangs there. You can see the step. And I looked up and this whole entrance was covered with this big shapeless black mass. And I was just startled and I pointed my finger at it. And I turned around to my people behind me. And when I looked back, it kind of shimmered, like it kind of gathered itself and it whooshed off down into the tunnel. And you could oh, see the light, nice. you could see the step, the pipe and everything, still pointing. I turned to my people, I said, did you guys just see that? I'm gonna leave my light right there. And we're gonna go in here and visit Mr. Boots. Oh, mate. Oh, gosh. I know this is a good idea. It, every sense is hey, Mr. Boots. heightened now. My name's Omar. I just wanted to come and hang out with you for a little bit. Please be nice. All right. I'm scared. I'm scared. I wonder where this goes to. They didn't really tell me. Oh, mate. I would stay in the middle of there and do some sort of seance, mate. I'd stop right there and just, I don't know, strip off, I feel like oil up, reach down and, grab and get the bloody the Ouija board out. But don't get the Ouija board. Don't do, we don't do Ouija boards. Like, like down there. Yo, I'm scared. Hey, Mr. Boots, how come Cindy doesn't like it down here? Can you make a noise or something down here? Thought I heard you walking earlier. But I'm thinking it was that water heater making all that noise. As if the pipe just went ting, 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 ting. So there's a light bulb right in front of me, and it went off without even being connected at one point. Found the light bulb, and I took pictures for him and everything, you know, debunking, trying to gather some evidence. Then when I asked Tamara about it, she said, oh, yeah, that light bulb it doesn't even have a wire to it. It's not even connected. It hasn't no. worked as long as I've been here. No. But very clearly on the video, that light bulb lights up. We've not been able to get it to do it again, but that was the third time I went in, and that's plenty. Okay, Mr. Boots, I'm going to close my eyes, and if you want to appear in the darkness, do so. You can smile, you can do whatever you want. Oh, imagine that, mate, smiling at you, la. But do not appear yourself to me. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> oh, mate. Hey, hey, well done, man. This is good. This is good. Come on, Chris. Here's the physic. Look, there she is. Okay. Oh, my God. What was that? Guys, I cannot believe I'm in here by myself. Like, there have been thousands of people that have crossed through here. Like, thousands. This is where I'm being drawn to. I don't know why. Oh my god. Holy sh I don't like the energy in here, guys. Oh man. Look at the floors. It's the high ceilings as well. That's what does it. That's what makes it even freaky. 
Even more freaky. I'm being real honest with you guys right now. Oh my god, there's someone walking. Someone's here. I feel female spirit. Can you come and talk to me? Laura? Laura. A lot of footsteps. You can come toward me. Just please don't turn my camera off. I do not give you permission to do that. It's so sad. Like the energy here is just sad. Like I don't even- I'm sure a ghost, if you said I don't, I don't give you- If I was a ghost, right? And if someone said, I don't give you permission to do that, I'd be like, fuck off. I do what I want, mate. I'm, I'm barely dead. Do what I fucking want. I have another word for it. I can't even describe it. The energy here is just so fucking sad. Like my heart is racing. I just feel like it's not fucking fair. Like- Sarah. Sarah. I just feel like I want to take a moment. I don't get it. That's what I'm hearing. I don't get it. Like they don't quite understand their death or what happened. I feel like they're living on repeat, like in a loop. I'm so sorry. Guys, I'm honestly trying- Mate, she's maximum connecting right now, isn't she? Huh? I'm not to cry right now, I don't know. Like, I'm just getting really emotional. The shit that happened here is f***ed up. To women especially. Like, if I was alive in that time period, I would also think it was so f unfair. Participate. Here we go, look. I don't really Your know. fucking head's gonna start spinning around in a minute. I know what went down over here. I really don't, but there's so much movement around me right now. You can make that device in the other room go off. Whatever's easiest for you to communicate with me. Guys, I, like, I cannot describe, like, this unbearable feeling right now. It is so heavy and disgusting. I'm almost having flashbacks to some of the things that happened here that I can't even say on camera because they're so disgusting. And I feel like they know that I- just... No, not here. No, not here, not that, not that, well, not that, 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 here with me? Cause something drew me to this room. Or are you just trying to distract me? Sometimes I pick up on energy and emotion that distracts me. And it's always a concern going into locations because I feel like this might have been a distraction. Oh. There is just a woman laughing. What? I, you got I fucking heard that. There might have been a distraction. Oh, mate, mate, mate. Oh, wow, wow. Hello, chicken skin. There is just a woman. Oh. I know you guys heard that. Yeah, I did. Uh. Here we go now. Yeah, let's go. Come on, Josh. I've been here for a few minutes. I can't tell you how dark this freaking place is. Like, it is super dark. I'm going to show you guys. Whoa. Whoa. What? Sean. Oh. Holy. What? Holy shit. What? That was so loud. What was it, Hello? mate? I've got to rewind it. Whoa. Places. Like, it is super dark. I'm going to show you guys. Whoa. I, I, I don't know what it was. Whoa. Sean. Oh. Holy, holy shit. That was so loud. Hello? What did he hear? Who's out there?
That sounded like a chair or something moving. I didn't hear shit all, then mate. walkie-talkie went crazy. I heard that. Like voice, these creepy ass voices started coming across that. Oh Lord, let there not be anybody in this fucking place. Hello. <gasps> Alarms going off. Mate. Who is that that comes over my walkie-talkie? Side note, who the hell came up with the name walkie-talkie? Sounds like a five-year-old. Like some, someone said, hey, look, son, look what I've made. What would you call that? Walkie talkie. It's a walkie talkie. You can wear walkie talkie. That's a good name, son. Now they call it a walkie talkie. Where are you? That's out here. Oh, cold breeze. This area right here is so freaking cold. Can you hit that again for me? I know that sound came from out here. Just like that. That loud sound, it literally sounded like a chair or something moving. The walkie talkie goes freaking crazy. I'll have to go back and listen to it to hear if anything came across it. And then my alarm in that room was going off. That's three things, all at the exact same time. That helps validate that that was something paranormal. Okay, I'm gonna go back in here and see if we- I didn't hear the chair, but I heard the walkie-talkie. Can recreate. <coughs> it's so f I was about ready to show you guys how dark it was. Thank God I didn't shut that f light off. I'll show you guys real quick how f dark this room is. That's all I see wow. when I walk around this building. Yep. <laughs> so this is definitely alone in the dark. Yeah. What's weird is I keep getting like hot flashes. You know, like when you drink or you need sugar. Yeah, you just had a load of whiskey, mate. <laughs> and like your sugar level's low. Occasionally I feel like that here. I've got this huge headache. Are you affecting me? Do you make that loud bang like you did earlier? I mean, I have no way of explaining that. How all that happened at once. Oh, no. Yeah, way. yeah, yeah. It's on a wooden door. Yeah. Sean, can you hear me? I'm just waiting for something big to happen. I have no way of getting out of this building. My walkie-talkie's not working. Oh, shit. Oh, it did it again! It did it! Loud bang! It did it again! It did it again! And my walkie-talkie's not working. Oh, it did it again! Loud bang, and the walkie-talkie went off. No yeah. fucking way. Oh, man. You're a sweet... It's Tennessee whiskey. You're as smooth. The strawberry white, even with the cold, mate, I can get those fucking notes. Come on, Colin. That light just flickered. Right, Colin, right. You need to fucking get in there and do the shit, mate, all right? I've told you once, so I'm not going to tell you again. Get in there and do that shit. Let's go. On and off. In the f***ing... Solitary wing. <coughs> I'm just going to get my stuff. I'm going to go to a different part of this prison. Hello? Shaking. 
Hello? Okay, I'm gonna come get my stuff. Please, just let me, let me just grab my stuff real quick, okay? Well, stay in there, mate. What the hell? I don't know, but I'm gonna get out of this area. I need to take a break for a second. The hell is just turned on in my pocket. <laughs> Yeah. Of course, I turned the camera off for a split second to sit down right there on that bench, and I f turned the this thing off too. There was like a f extremely loud crashing noise from over here, like really loud. Like what? Shit, I'm running out. Of fuel. Oh Yeah, there's there's nobody over here. Hello? There's this thing waiting here. What the f Yeah, this is the bathroom right here. There's no one in there. I literally do not know what could have made that sound. I don't know if I could do the, the final stuff alone, man. Yeah, yeah, yes you can, mate. Come on, Colin. Here's the old gymnasium. The gymnasium. Is there anybody here in the old gymnasium? Dead quiet in here. You hear that? Do you hear how quiet it is? <laughs> yeah, you see, there's my light over there where I was sitting. You see how far away that was? I've got a funny feeling about it. something's gonna kick off, mate. This is the only way to get in and out of this area, is through here. And nobody is here. Honestly, did not think that this would be that freaky. And like, I'm really debating if I want to go to the really dark area because the story that they were telling us was like ridiculously dark where a person like, they were like f***ing with this thing and then all of a sudden this person like stopped breathing and didn't have a pulse. I don't know if I really am in the mood to f*** with that right now when I'm by myself. Like maybe if the <laughs> building was smaller. I like to consider myself brave. Like don't think that this is not hard to do. I'm like, ugh, my anxiety is just through the roof right now. Yeah, he's going to. Mate, uh, hopefully he's building it up for a grand finale. What the fuck is that? What the? Whoa. Was he phoning Omar? Get me out of here or something? This is where Twin Paranormal investigated, didn't they? And, uh... Sam and Colby? There is just a woman I know yep. you guys heard that. Elsewhere. Elsewhere. This was a f***ing distraction. 
I'm not feeling too good. I'm gonna be real honest with you. I'm kind of feeling a little nauseous. I don't know why. Okay, this is my energy. You are not to affect it. You are not to affect my energy. What the There's hell? There's so many places. What the hell is this shit up here, man? This is where you keep the dead bodies. Lisa. Lisa. There's so many places to go in here that, like, Look at the state of that. Like... Look at the state of that hallway. I'm going to get lost. Oh, mate. Okay, so I'm back in here. Can you talk to me now? Can you get close to this device in front of me? Show everyone that you're here. I heard you. It is chillingly cold in here. Like it is so freaking cold right now. Colder than it was before, but I am not feeling right at all. Okay. Was this it? You said his voice. his voice. Whose voice? Look at that thing up there. I did hear you over here. I heard you walking. I definitely feel you. Guys, I'm seeing a lot of shadows. There are mirrors everywhere. Mirrors are portals to the other side. Oh my god, who's this? I did not see this before. I kind of want to. Maximum mustache, please! I have everything in my pocket. Threatening. Threatening. Who, me or you? Or the man? As you can see, there's so many little rooms where things could have happened. Like, what is this window for? That's for passing your meal over. Are we ready to go upstairs? The third floor is definitely it, guys. Oh my god, it's so cold. Mate, I just heard... I, heard, I just heard talking. Yes. Oh my god, it's so cold. I... There was just shitloads of talking just then. Oh my god, it's so cold. I know that these stairs back here is where women would come up. I do not like this right now. There's so- I'm hearing maximum talking. I do not like this right now. There's so many places where energy can hide. Are there any other traumatic deaths that occurred here? Well, there's the legend of Lena, a lady of the evening. She had gotten tricked into that profession by whoever owned the saloon at that time. She was killed in this building oh. and they oh. call her the lady in blue. She's usually seen gazing out of the mirror that's by the spiral staircase. She's oh. probably one of the most longest lasting spirits that you can trace back in this club. It's interesting because on my way here, I was picking up on a female spirit and that kind of gave her trust to this place and was killed. So it was pretty sad. Like it was really heavy and it was making me really emotional. And that does fit Lena, the story that we hear of her, absolutely. This stairwell, this is where they would sneak people in. I feel like this is where they would sneak the women in. Did anything happen over here? Oh my God. What? What? Hey. Hey. Let's go. I have no way of getting out of this building. And my walkie talk is not working. Oh, it did it again. Loud bang and the walkie talkie went off. No fing way. What the freak? Listen, I've been doing the ghost hunting since 2006, and I've oh. never experienced something like this before where you have three things like that happen bang, walkie talkie, alarm. Not he needs to get back in there with his brothers, mate. Once, but twice. Alarm. I'm trying not to stare out there because I don't want to see something. <laughs> if I see a f***ing shadow or a creature. Can you come in this room with me, please? Don't want to look out there, but he wants to invite it into his, in his own room. No. Is that like a phone? Get out there, mate. Go on.
Whoa, Jesus. Lord, baby Jesus. I do not want to be in here right now. I like Lord, baby to Jesus. Or somebody. John, can you hear me? 16. Can anybody hear me? Mayday! John, if you can hear me, there's something in here with me. Yeah. Mayday, I mayday. I'm walking and banging. I don't think I'm alone anymore. The freak. I'm trying to figure out how this is exactly safe. I'm alone in this speakeasy. They're literally three blocks, like, across town. I'm locked in the freaking building. They lock the door. And I can't get hold of anybody. You would think at some point somebody would come look for me. Hey. John, can you hear me? What the hell? I make my way over there and get my cell phone. I just can't see anything. Oh shit, that freaked me right out. I'm keeping my phone on me now because this has gotten way too creepy. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. <laughs> Come on, pick up your freaking phone. And forwarded to an automatic voice message system. I honestly, I can't. I've tried calling, texting, walkie-talkies. It's like every safety precaution. Send the Billy Pigeon, mate. Should we put in place is not working. Hey, Omar just texted back. Can you talk to me? No. Oh. Can you see me? Yes. I thought it was Omar then. <laughs> what is your name? Oh my god. Oh, bloody hell, mate. That's freaky as shit. Stay States of America, baby, 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 baby. You know baby, what baby, my name baby. is? Where are you at right now? Dead. I don't know if I just said Josh or. Oh my god. Mate, if that darkness doesn't creep you out, that is. You can come sit on the couch with me, there's plenty of room. Imagine if it did. Imagine if you just saw an indentation. Oh. Whoa. In the next episode of oh. Alone, Paranormal Edition. I'm getting something big on the bed. It looks like it's dying in a way. Ah, 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 ah. Something just touched my back. So if, it, if this land is cursed, what guards this place? Oh my... It said me. Who was that that sneezed? Oh! 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 oh. 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 oh man! <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. If you did like the reaction, please make sure you subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Bye bye. Get the merch at caspersite.com. Just Rambo it.